I was uh, involved in organizing this event at MAN because I felt that th there are so many international students on campus and they need an occasion to wear their cultural outfits and come together and share it with all the students at MAN. So that inspired me to work with the SEO office and to organize this beautiful event where I can see everybody's wearing their cultural outfits, everyone's happy listening to their music and I love that. Uh, we're, we, might, we can say that we're uh, one of the original peoples of this land and uh, so we want to be representing that pride and I think maybe we're the only indigenous in, uh, couple in this, uh, two people in this uh, show. I'm really proud to be Inuk and I really wanted to show my culture here today and like Stan said I think it was really good to have some indigenous representation as well and I'm, I'm really glad that we were able to come out. I'm wearing an Amautic, which is a traditionally an Inuit woman's coat, and normally I would have a baby in the big coat on the back here, but I don't have a baby just yet, so it's still empty for now. <laughs> so I am originally from a small island called Mauritius. I am wearing a traditional korta right now. Uh, so this outfit is mostly for uh, Muslim and uh, South Asian festivities in the country and we usually wear that uh, whenever we gather in families or with friends. Uh, the shoes is called uh, champas, so these are uh, pretty light shoes that uh, people wear, so we don't really wear uh, you know, actual shoes and everything, it's mostly light, so that uh, if you want to take it out or go for prayers and everything, you can just easily take it off. Yeah. I was here for the last cultural fashion show, and that's how I found out about it, and I helped organize this. I'm wearing like a traditional Gujarati wedding outfit, kind of thingy yeah I I like I I like any excuse to dress up so this is a great this is a great way for me to do it